Malawi is a country in Africa that not a lot of people know about, but it's feel very happy people. We're very proud of our country, even though we're not as developed as others. My name is Kutama Shedai South Gachingwe. I'm a student at South End. I'm a coder, not the best at it, but at least I coded something. <laughs> Using technology, I want to put Malawi on the map. Good morning, everyone. M-Hub is Malawi's first technology and innovation hub. And we champion the development of local technology solutions. How many have an interest in coding? People need technology to come and help them in their daily lives. And then coding was a way of doing that. I didn't know, actually, that you could add stuff to Google Maps. So going to M-Hub gave me the sense that I could contribute to others and help other people. Um, while we came up with this project of mapping, we saw that there is a gap in Malawi. Most of the countries in Africa, they do have mapping communities. But in Malawi, we don't have one. Oh, yeah, actually. It shows that you've got 30 points. If we can come and add stuff to Malawi, People would want to come here, tourists, knowing that you know they can go somewhere using our maps. We're moving around blind and we're trying to find places that are not on Google Maps. Okay, let's find the train. So open your maps and search St. Columbus CCP Church. The next person want to visit. So we just review everything, so we know they don't have a website. We check the phone number is correct, and we check the name that is correct, and the location is correct, then we're good. We went to this place over here, Little Tots. It's a nursery school. The nursery wasn't on a map, we just mapped it right here. Temporary residents, if they know that this is a nursery school, they can come and leave their children here, a place to pray, you know, just a place of comfort, knowing that you know where you are, and you know where to travel and how to get there. See this pharmacy? Oh, no, it's not mad. Yeah. So maybe we can do that now? Based on what we've done the last couple of days, I think that it enhanced their confidence a lot because it showed them that they can do what other people don't think that they'll be able to do. It feels great that I'm giving back to my community. It feels like if I solve these challenges, I'll hopefully be able to make an impact in girls' lives where they're able to look at me as a role model. I feel excited because it means the development of Malawi is going to be great. That's a globally equal society where the women and the girls are also able to voice out and speak up about things that's technology technology things, innovation things, human rights things, and everything in general that affects the people that are around us. You feel powerful when you can actually help people find places. It makes me feel as if we can solve our own problems, so it's not finding things, we can do it. Just as long as we're willing to go, take out our phones, just use a bit of data, and then help somebody who really needs it by mapping it.